Martele literally means hammered. And I think for this reason, we have to be very careful where we apply the stroke and how we apply the stroke. It can sound very ugly and unnecessary. If I can give you an example of how this works. So what we do is we place the bow on the string, let's say in the lower middle half. We apply some pressure with the right hand. And then, as soon as the bow starts moving, we let go. And the same with the up bow at the tip. We apply some pressure with the fingers, so the stick is really moving down. You can see that going there. And then move the bow. The other thing to remember that's very important about this stroke is where the point of contact is. What I mean by that is where the bow appears between the bridge and the fingerboard here. Now, if the bow goes too close to the fingerboard, we get a scrunching sound, as you can hear, which doesn't really work because we need a little more tension on the string. So I would come towards the bridge. Now, I don't want to be right on the bridge because we get a sort of ponticello-type sound. Again, that's a little too harsh for the sound. So somewhere just away from the bridge, about here, I would say, Now, if I can play you an example of a piece that uses this, this is Preludium and Allegro by Fritz Kreisler. I'll just play you the first part of this. <laughs> ¶¶ 